What's going on everyone so in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to set up your aim training routine basically if you're new to aim training uh how you go about it and how you get better at it when it comes to playing call of duty or whatever game you're playing on mouse and keyboard so the first thing you're going to want to do is go to aim labs it's completely free you don't have to pay for anything guys I recommend this, especially if you're just starting out. A lot of people like Kovacs, but I prefer Aim Labs, and I'm going to show you why. So we are in Aim Labs right here. I'm going to go quickly over my settings <clears throat> real quick. And if you guys just want to copy these settings, you can. Um, but basically, this is everything I use on Aim Labs, getting you set up right uh, for my graphics. Uh, this is what I use. And then for my visuals, these are my visuals right here. Uh, controls, you know, I play Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Uh, it's Warzone, but this is what I play at. Uh, the FOV, what I was told by my trainer, he was telling me that you only, you don't want to max this out to 120. You want to keep it at 103 on certain scenarios and 110 on certain scenarios, right? So you never want to max this out. Um, and this is what I use. And remember, this whole thing, guys, is literally just to give you really good mouse control. Um, right here is my game, my bindings. Um, basically all I did was press restart to space so I can restart real quick. And skins, I really don't use skin. So those are my settings right there. Now we're gonna hop over onto the Aim Labs, uh, the Voltaic benchmarks, I guess you can say. Voltaic benchmarks, what you're gonna do is after you make your Aim Labs account, you're gonna to go to the Voltaic Benchmarks, and this is the app, I'm gonna leave it down in the description below, and this is what you're gonna to wanna to do, guys. You're gonna to wanna to go through each and every single one of these, right? You're gonna play through it one time, and then you're gonna to try to max them all out. So right now, I'm in gold. You wanna max all of these out in order to uh, move on to the next, right? And sometimes it took me about a week to max all these out, and now I'm on the intermediate, and I um, went through a certain, a couple of scenarios here, but um, <clears throat> basically what you're gonna wanna do is link your account, and once you do that, you can go to any one of these benchmarks, right? And then say if I want to do, uh, I don't know, what's, what's a hard one? Um, and also, the, you guys see here, there's clicking, there's tracking, and there's switching. Um, so let me see here. We got angle shot intermediate. We're just gonna go through angle shot, right? So right here, we're gonna go in, we're gonna go open up the aim labs handler, and then boom, aim labs opens up. Remember, you're gonna wanna launch aim labs in order to do this. And as you guys can see, my high score is 889. So I'm just gonna go through this scenario real quick. 739, really bad score. Now we're gonna exit out of this, right? After you exit out, now you can go to the next scenario, right? The next scenario, you can just alt tab, right? And then you can just go to like, oh, I wanna do wave shot novice, right? Okay, I'm gonna go here, open the lab, and then it's just gonna go right into the next scenario. And you guys are gonna completely go through this and continue to try, max all of them out. And once you complete this and get them all maxed out, you can go to the next one. Intermediate. Now, some of these, like, uh, I'm gonna show you, I haven't downloaded any of the other ones. So, a big thing, always remember to, like, exit lobby if you want to switch over. Um, I haven't done this one, so we got VT pull track, 
uh, we're going to open this one up and I think it's going to ask me to download it. Yep. So it's going to ask you to download it. You just want to hit yes. Well, it should have op automatically opened it up, but it didn't. So we're going to go back here. Boo, VT pull track, boom, open handler. Sometimes it's a little buggy, but you guys get the main idea. It's downloaded, boom, right there. And we can just keep going. And I can just go in and I can uh, just do this score real quick and uh, try to get a good score. And this one's pretty tough, but. You guys get the point. But I want to do this because I haven't done it yet. And I want to show you the uh, score. That uh, how it updates. So this thing is jumping back and forth quite a bit holy that is close oh my goodness wow okay so we got our first score right you can go here and that's what i like aim labs about you can go and click here and kind of see like how other people do it and how good they are um this guy is like really really smooth but uh now that we completed that now i'll go down here um Remember how I didn't do anything here. I'm going to refresh the score. And it goes back to intermediate, but boom, right there. VT pull track right there. And we're getting, that's pretty close to Jade. So guys, this is how you set up the aim labs and how you, uh, you know, try to aim train, do all of the scenarios, try to get better. And you're going to see, uh, how these, uh, scores, uh, improve yourself like so you're going to see how what you're weak at like right here i'm really weak at this i'm really weak at this i'm really weak at these two so i or four i really need to work on these and so once you get them grind a scenario out there is really no uh how much time you put in uh you can do this however long you want um i find that really fun just try seeing the improvement and getting better sometimes you're going to hit a plateau it's just about how much you grind and keep through it so guys, that's it for today's video. I am actually gonna be updating my Discord so that we can post our scores and post our progress to see how we are doing as a community. And uh, I'm excited to do this with you guys and continue. Um, as always guys, remember to stay blessed and stay humble. And I'll catch you in another video. Peace.